All right, guys. Welcome back to another video of Subnautica. Um, let's see. We are gonna go not that way. Going right there. So what I'm planning to do is get the resources for the serum, whatever. Hello, Queen. She is tired. And we already opened up this portal, so let's go in. I do it. I hear a reaper. Come on, get me out of the water. Or at least decently. All right, so now we are going to go to our uh, ship. Let's see. Which is really far away. Wow. A thousand five hundred. Eh, it shouldn't take that long, I would say. And then we'll get these resources uh, the, or these different plants and plant seeds, because I think we have all of them, honestly, or almost. And the ones that we need are close to the base. Life pod too. Maybe we should uh, look at that at some point. Ooh. I don't remember sea grass being here. Boom! 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 I feel a lot better being here, not gonna lie. After being in that volcanic place for so, so long. Hey, right, ship. Peace. Man, this upgraded, uh, like, jetpack is so handy, man. Amazing. Camera, too. That way. So that's like 500 meters, this is like 600 meters, so there isn't that much of a difference in how far away it is. Is this, does this game look better all of a sudden? I don't know why, it just looks really good and clean right now. Speed. Wow, that did not take like any time. At all. I thought it would take a little bit longer. We are back at base. Yay! Oof. Alright, let's get these resources. What do we need? Uh, bulb bush. Bulb bush. Brain coral. We need a sea crown. We need one of the ghost weeds. Gel sag. Uh, bulb bush. Fungi sample. Eye stock. Fungi sample. I know where that is. Let's go get some food real quick. Let's go get a snack and then fix up our stuff. Oh, wait. There's a bulb thing in here. There was one outside as well, and I'm thinking about it. Um, what else do we need? Fungi sample we get from near the aura, like the tree groves, I think. And then the uh, eye stalk seed is from over here in that direction. Is there any eye stalks in here? No. I knew we would need the eye stalk at some point. Actually, no. But I just had a feeling I should grab it. Oh, uh, let's check. Nuclear reactor is going well. We know. 
One peeper. One peeper and that. Let's go get a peeper. I like these peepers, honestly. Like, if it's a normal pe peeper or these peepers, I like these peepers a lot more. And you know what? I'm gonna actually cook one up. Because I know, like, you don't gotta have a balanced meal, so you can just eat fruit all the time in this game. But, it kind of, uh... Feels kind of like roleplay or something. Dark, dense meat, good meal. Give my character something good. Having the munchies. Um... Honestly, yeah. Let me go get, like, uh... Two more. Two more and then finish off with some fruit. I think. Alright. I'd probably be full food. And then I'll go grab a water bottle downstairs. Uh, and it gives me a second to recount my thoughts. So, fungal area. Like, east ish east between east to southeast and then bulb bush behind us not bulb bush eye stalks uh you got a water bottle i don't need two water bottles do i i might as well honestly what is it now i'm thinking about it Nutrition block 75, water only 50. Water drains feels like a lot more. So we do not have an eye stock over here. Nope. Hello, Wells. Man, the jetpack uh, propulsion is insane. Under the she. Oh. Did I click something on my headset? No. Why did it seem like the audio lowered for a second? Anything in here? No. No. Just an egg. Did we ever find out what was in that egg? Violets, yep. Creature egg. I thought we did have one of these. If not, I'll throw it away. If we already got it, but till then. How about I just uh, grab one? Hopefully it's something cool, because I don't know what it could be. Out of here. You're stinky. Little stinker. Bold bush wouldn't be down there, would you think? No? I wouldn't think so. I think it would be like right here. And then we got the reaper right there, and another reaper right there. I know the biz. I ain't scared no more. It's like Home Alone. I'm not scared anymore. JK, I am. I will always be scared. But the ghost leviathans? Nah, they're my... They're my friends. Whoa, why did you exit? Where's the bulb bush? Hello, Wells. Alright, let me check if the bull bushes are down here. I don't need to go that far to check. No. It wouldn't be down here. More kelp area. Mm. 
Would it be over here, though? I'm gonna poo myself if there's a reaper near us. Uh, huh. Hello, giant ship piece. We've been here before, I think. Some of those horn plants are here. Eye stalks. We got any down here? Hello? Nope. Thank you. Stupid warpers. The warpers are kind of scary as well, honestly. I don't like how they can just teleport me out of my ship. That's the, that's the only reason why they would be even frightening. Just a little bit. I don't like how it's become dark. Alright, let me just go to the tree chop area, honestly. Get me out of this dark abyss area. I'm closing my eyes. I'm scared. I'm not actually closing my eyes. I'm a big boy. Oh, this is the area I needed to be. For the bulbs. I feel safe now. I feel very safe. Yes. I see you, stinky. Little stinker eye bulbs. Huh. Okay. I'm gonna grab two. I wanna take take one back to base. Go back to base, rest up, take a nap. Because this is getting very dark. It seems to be. And then we can go to the f fungal area. Where all the angels or whatever. Angel rays or something. It's not even that if you see the reaper and the reaper's chasing you, it's not. I mean, uh, the reaper's war, war is what's scary. I still can't believe if I actually screamed that one video with the reaper chasing me or something. I don't know if that was an actual scream or it was a, uh, me doing it for improv or whatever. I could actually not tell you. I feel like it was for improv and my brain just did it for some reason. But we're just going to pretend like that didn't actually exist. Exit the base. And daytime. Daytime. Nighttime. Daytime. Nighttime. Ugh. That way. Bonk. Come on. Man, how far away is the fungal area? Where did it go? We're coming up on it, I think. 
I touch one of the fishies. Interesting. The water get extra murky or something? Why did it take so long for? Or is it the area loading in or something? Don't care. Didn't ask. I want to take it back to base. Plant some. Or no, it's just very dark for some reason. Is it turning nighttime actually? Is there no more day? Did I do that accidentally? Whoop, she die easy. Ooh. Nice. There we go. Nice speed boost. Delicious. I will take those speed boosts any day. If you didn't have the bronze suit with a grappling hook, like, super duper missing out. My submarine is still n near the volcano place, but I didn't... Because my whole plan was kind of like, oh, let me drive it back up, and that'll be the video. And I'm like, nah. I can... I can do... Th blah, blah, blah. I can grab these materials with just the bronze suit. We are getting close to the end, folks. The end of this series. And then after that, um... Because Subnautica was actually my very first episodes and stuff like that. Which you can definitely see how everything progressed when I got better with the audio and Starship Troopers a little bit. But you can see how everything progressed to where I got better audio. I understood what I was doing. Oh, uh, what do I have that's too much extra? Fungal samples. Oh. Oh. I just have to drop the samples. Don't know where they want. Alright, let's go inside for a quick snack. Crab fish. Let's just put that egg in there. See what it what the creature is. Um Nope, did not mean to open up that. You know what we can do is make one of these good batteries, I think, right? I think I just want to make one. Uh, I already have the thing on me. Wow, I don't know why I even went outside to the prom suit. Gold and silver. Copper. Silver right here. Magnite. I'm saying that correctly. Boom. Now we can make the super duper good battery. Alright, we are good. One, two. And then bad battery, bad battery. Grab one of these, bad battery. Alright, now we got an extra battery. Wow, it really does seem like you're really powerful if you have this in your hands. Like a rifle or something. Like you, you go, oh, we forgot to eat. But it's like a rifle and it's just like, yeah, I can take on this planet. Don't even try me, bro. Don't even try me. I can only eat one at a time, which sucks. Nope. Kept it on opening up Steam. Some pictures. No, stop doing that. Let me grab an extra thing of water, please. Thank you. All right. Uh, scratch my arm. I am stuck. I'm stuck. I'm no longer stuck. Oh, that was going to be a, such a good run. Alright. 
and I ran into him. Whoops. That this is a really bad run. Oh, the whoa. Look at that tendril. Whipped into the ground for a second. Nope. Not you. My bad. I am being very silent now I'm thinking about it. I haven't been talking. I mean, I have been talking, but kind of not as well. What's completely fine? Uh, we are in the... Okay. Was just not able to get high enough to see. I don't want to go that way. I want to go up here. Oh! All right. Get out of here. Don't even try to bite me, man. Don't even try it. This way. This is a giant wall separating the two, basically. I don't know where the island, giant island is. I've already lost it. I knew there was going to be someone around here. Get out of here. What is this? We already got it. We haven't really been to the floating islands. That's for sure. Let's take a stroll. Unless we have the whole family over here trying to eat my ass. Oh my god, I'm getting out of here. Never mind. Oh god. Alright, we found the island. Oh my god, he has so much space aids. This is not the island. He's basically right next to the island, though. I got worried for a moment. I was just like, where are we? When everything got murky. There we go. We are now safe. So apparently there is a small glitch a little bit in the game. And there's like someone saying like not like trying to speed run the game without buying, getting any vehicles or something. And one of the Le Reaper Leviathans on the other side of this island, like in that direction, apparently uh, sometimes goes through the island. Which that is uh, not something I want to ever witness. Ever. I'd rather leave that to the imagination. Ouch.
Yeah. I do not care about that little Leviathan. Get out of here, fam. Why is it so dark? Oh, okay. We're good now. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. And it is time, guys. We're doing it. We're curing the planet. We are not, guys. We are not curing the planet. We gotta make it inside. Where's the submarine? How far away? Oh, God. Submarine or go all the way to back to base? We go to the submarine. I went through the cage somehow. I hear volcanic noises and I don't understand why. I mean, you know what? I'll take that back. We uh, we are legit on oh a gosh darn uh, volcanic area. Why is the game acting like I'm in the water? All right, we're moving. That spider's going insane. Let me repair. All right, time to go see the hello spider floating. Out of my way. What is he doing? He couldn't possibly be mad, right? He's mad. He's mad. Whoops. I can't see. What's happening out there? Soldier! What's my upgrades? Oh, wait. Can I just... I can see now. He's not that bad. I look too wonderful for him to be that mad. I think he's mad. I went on the wrong side. Where did he go? Hey, there's a big giant blue crystal. Where did he go? Guess he went over there. I'm gonna go crazy if he comes very close. I turn behind me and he's just like, hey, what's up? How you doing, fam? Oh, wait. Right here. Bring me to the ship. Thank you. Whew. All right. I need to make the enzymes. Organic substance derived from plants found in the emperor's natural breeding grounds. Designed to trigger a hatchling response. Om nom 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 nom. Excuse me. Alright. 
we know where to go. The real, the real question will be, I don't actually want to grapple. Just in case if he's right around this corner. That's what we got to be careful. Just in case if he's right around this corner. He seems mad. Whoa. Move. Yeah, that's right. What are you gonna do? Fireball, I guess. Didn't hit it. I want to stun him and kill him. No, I'm kidding. I want to scan him. I will eventually scan him. He has my word. He can't stop me. I'm one man army. Uh, which direction? This one, right? I'm coming in. Well, that one dude is not happy. Definitely going to be a longer vid, but I wanted to completely do this. All right. Insert hatching enzymes. Let's go. What we've been trying to do. Babies. What are they going to do? Oh. Hello, guy. You mind if I scan you? My young are swimming for the shallows. I thank you. Their freedom is my end. What will it be like, I wonder, to go to sleep and never wake up? Perhaps next we meet. I will be an ocean current, carrying seas to a new land. Or a creature so small, it sees the gaps between the grains of sand. Farewell, friend. No. Goodbye. It was nice seeing you. I'm going to touch it. I should have done that with the gloves off. Look, you see my arm? No more green blisters. And watch this. Self scan complete. Vital signs normal. No remaining sign of bacterial infection. Yeah, I'm not infected no more. Let's read this. A juveline emperor specimen producing a highly 
potent form of enzyme 42, which should be capable of fully killing individuals with alien bacterium. This species hatches relatively fully formed and independent, perhaps reflecting the fact that they must fend for themselves when they are first born away from their parents. This specimen is healthy and exhibiting signs of positive attitude to life. I'm losing oxygen. Sea emperor eggs. That's some hardy shell. Uncommonly strong, uncommonly strong shell lining. Organic growth on the exterior suggests these eggs may be concluded hundreds or thousands of years old. Alien devices penetrate the outer shell layer, likely designed to supply them with nutrients and, and to isolate them from the surrounding environment. Like many eggs on 4546b, they do not contain a nutrient supply which is solely exhausted by the embryo. Instead, they must exist in a form of natural stasis, awaiting appropriate hatching conditions. A uh, fetal organism, the high genetic match between the organisms and the Leviathan in the vicinity, they appear, appear to be stable and healthy. It is likely that that ideal hatching conditions for the eggs vary considerably from the ideal survival conditions for for the parent. Alright. Goodbye, my friend. This is the last time we will see you. Alright, you can just shut up being up there, please. Goodbye. Your babies are nowhere to be found all of a sudden. Bye bye. Into the green portal. The babies. I the baby. Ooh. You're just barfing up the enzymes. Hi, the babies. You're so pretty. Such a little bye bye. Adorable. Can we can we keep one? Spade fish egg discovered. Spade fish. Can we keep one? Huh? I'll I'm, I'll promise I'll take care of them. I'll take care of them. I promise. But yeah, this is the end of the episode. We did it. We cured the planet. But now, how are we going to get off this hunk of junk planet? But yeah, this is the, the end of the episode. You guys have a good day and bye-bye. Uh,